The Port River area is a significant part of our state and is home for many of us, as well as a diverse range of animal and plant species. However, a rising sea level and sinking land, known as subsidence, threaten the communities living around the Port River, one of the most vulnerable areas to flooding in South Australia. We've had a taste of flood damage as recently as May 2016, when a high tide of 2.7 metres with wind gusts became a 3.9 metre tide. There are actions we must take to stop this from happening. These actions can also benefit the environment. We can foster living shorelines. This is called eco-engineering and includes installing shellfish reefs and regenerating mangroves and salt marshes. They provide natural shore protection and environmental benefits like nursery habitats for fish and other critters. We can also attach seawall tiles to existing seawalls and design them into higher seawalls. These turn seawalls from flat, barren concrete into complex three-dimensional habitats that offer homes and protection to a variety of marine animals. It's not too late to avoid an emergency. We need to plan and act now. Through environmentally friendly seawalls, we have environmental benefits with protections in place to prevent disaster. Win-win. Our community will be more resilient when governments tackle these known risks. Visit estuary.org.au to learn more.